Well, there is a huge cottonwood tree that serves as a towering landmark that looms above a neighborhood in White Bear Lake. Ren Clayton learned the long history between the tree and its owner. So this is the tree. Sunny Sondheim's house gets an awful lot of shade. Back here, of course, you get, whoa. <laughs> That's because tucked away in the backyard of this White Bear Lake home looms a giant cottonwood tree. If you stand across the street, you can see it way high up above everything else. Sondheim moved in about 50 years ago. It was much smaller then, but still impressive. Five people could hold hands around it. This is not the biggest cottonwood tree in Minnesota. The largest one on record is 32 feet in circumference in Chippewa County. This one measures about 24 feet all the way around. This was leaning up against the tree a long time ago and the tree just grew up around it. Growing together for half a century. But now this one story house and its towering tree is up for sale. Will you miss the tree when you move away? Yeah. I think so. It, it's, it's just another stage in my life. I'll be 84 in August, so it's time to move on. Sonny will move to a retirement home in July, saying goodbye to a comforting constant. It's going to be sad in a way, you know, because I spent so many years here. And it'll be also a little bit um, hopeful about looking into the next phase of my life and what that's going to be like. So it'll be a new adventure. In White Bear Lake. That's mainly what life is, is an adventure. Ren Clayton, WCCO News. And we wish Sunny well. She says that the tree really hasn't created many problems during their five decade run together, except for preventing her from getting satellite TV because <laughs> her giant tree would block the signal. The sacrifices you make. For the yard that you want. <laughs> there was a period of time when that was an issue. Giant satellite dishes <laughs> needing the signal. Right.